Hey YouTube, what's going on? Uh, back with another video. Well, today we got another chew review going on. Um, like I said in my previous chew videos that I haven't tried too much chew because I'm not a chew guy. Like I, I like dip better than I do um, chew. But <clears throat> I'm at the last little bit of this uh, Red Man and uh, original Red Man original, and I thought I'd give it a review. I mean, I had I made a video of it, but I didn't like the way it turned out, so we're making it again. Let's go ahead and give her a whiff here. And like everything else that's chew, um, oh, it smells raisins. But some other people might have a different opinion. But like, I'm, I like uh, Stoker's Peach chewing tobacco I had. It, it smelled like raisins too, but freaking, it had a peach flavor smell to it. So obviously, but this this is original and it smells like raisins. Which, raisins aren't bad, but if you don't like raisins, you're fucked. <laughs> but, uh, let's go ahead and put a chew in here. Like I said, I'm at the last little bit, and as you, if you all have chewed before, that last little bit of the bag is, like, <clears throat> all, like, chopped up, which kind of sucks, which I'm not going to put a big one in. In all honesty, I'm not, I'm not going to do it. Yeah, that's me. I, I'm not. I'm not doing a big one today. Hmm. All right. Chew on that for a little bit. Give you a review on it. But uh, yeah. It's not the bag itself. I mean, it's pretty, you know, it's like, a, it brings you back, I feel like it brings you back to, like, old times, like, it's an old time feel to it, like, like, got grit to it, you know what I mean, like, but, it's green, you know, red man, and all that, freaking, it's a nice little bag, it's got the, Resealable pouch, you know the Ziploc thing. It's it's not a bad little pouch, you know. Uh, <clears throat> my check of the day. The Confederate camo. And uh, yeah, <clears throat> I wanted to get another my jug. The the POW man. The POW in my jug looks fucking sick. I mean there's so much detail on that. My birthday's coming up soon and Christmas too, so hopefully I get, you know, some stuff like that, but hey. If I don't I don't. Um I do have some shout outs to give. The first one goes to Joey Led's Dippin' 94. I want to tell you what, dude. I've watched your videos before I watched, like, anyone else's, like, when I got on here. I, there's something about your videos that it, you're just fucking hilarious, and I like that. And I don't want to make it seem uh, weird or anything, but... You're kind of the reason why I started making videos a little bit, but I'm like, huh? I mean, I I love making videos, dude. So thank you for that, and uh, thank you for the shout out and your uh, Stoker's Mint review. Appreciate that, man. Uh, like I said in the comment. Uh, 
on your video, I said I, I hated asking for shout outs, which I really do. I, I'm not, I don't have very many subscribers. I think I'm like 13 or something like that. And I've been almost, it's almost been a year, which I mean, I, I ain't got very many subscribers. I, I, hell, I should have more than what that, you know, 13, but I ain't worried about subscribers. Like I said before in my last few videos, you know, I'm not worried about subscribers. If you guys like my videos, you know, that's great, you know, I, I mean, I want, I think that is awesome when people subscribe and stuff, but I'm just making my videos just out of pure enjoyment. I'm not doing it for like money reasons or like, yeah, I'm just giving people my point of view on dips and shoes and stuff like that. And trying to help out the beginners along the way, you know. But, uh, yeah, I'm not, like I said, I'm not doing this for the subscribers, but. Like I said, uh, thanks for the shout out, uh, Jenny Led's Dippin', 94. Um. Okay, so this brings me to my next shout out. <clears throat> Chub fucker. You're awesome too, man. I'll tell you what, freaking I watch your videos when you make some. I mean You make pretty cool videos. I like your intros and stuff. It's awesome. And I was lucky enough to be part of one of your intros, so thank you for that. In including me in your video. That was awesome. Um so uh that about wraps up the shout outs um we'll go ahead and review this chew like there's really not much to review with the chew there's no packability you know uh, if you put a you know it stays right there in the cheek if if you're not dumb about it and don't sit there and like that you know not to death, like chew on it to death, like bubble gum. Because if you do that, it's going to break up in a million pieces. And like I said in my other video, it'll be one of the worst chewing experiences in your life. I'm not even joking. But if you just kind of keep it right there, see, I got mine kind of in my cheek and kind of down toward my teeth. If you just kind of gnaw on it just a little bit. And not a full one chew, but just a little gnaw here and there. You'll be good to go. You get a good, a good amount of spit. Almost every chew, you spit a lot. I like, uh, like, it's a pretty good amount, like I said. Uh, you spit black. Like all chews, almost. I mean, I haven't came across a chew that I haven't spit black blood. Um, the nicotine content, I really couldn't tell you because I have a tolerance, and I, I mean, I, I can't really feel anything like that little uh, chew I threw in that really ain't gonna do nothing. I, I build up a tolerance over time, so I wouldn't be able to tell you. But I'm guessing it's probably got a decent amount. Which, you know, I mean, to the beginner dipper, you know, it would probably do something to you, but. Um. Like I said, when you get to the bottom of the bag, you got your wife's a little bit of flutters if you can't manage it. Um, overall, I'd probably give this about a eight out of ten. It's kind of sweet, which is all right. I mean, I'm just not a chew guy. I, I'm really not. You are. I mean. I chew every now and again just because I want to give my gums a break and I mean I do like to taste the chew every now and again but I'm not going to dip it every day like chew it every day. I, I couldn't do that. I, I, ugh, I, I couldn't. But 
This is about an 8 out of 10 for me. It's, uh, like I said, it's kind of sweet. It's got the raisin flavor to it. It's about all there is with chew. Um, I haven't made a video in so long. One, because college is, uh, keeping me really busy. <clears throat> I'll tell you, it's, it's getting pretty hard. I got finals week coming up and sometime in December. I don't even, it's not bad. I don't even know when it is hardly, but, uh. I'm going to be busy. <laughs> um, in the, my previous videos, I've been like updating you on my uh, baby cousin that was um, born. And um, he was a premature baby. He wasn't ready to be born yet, but he's out of the hospital now. He's home. And... He's doing great, so thank you for all giving me your thoughts and prayers if you did, you know. Um, you know, he's the cutest little thing I've ever seen in my life, but um, he's doing good. He's home now, so it's all that matters. Um. Ugh, spitting a lot. But, um, the high State Buckeyes doing great this season, football season. We got Indiana Saturday. It's like November 21st, I think it is right now. Who knows when I'll be able to upload this video, but, uh, <clears throat> yeah, they're doing pretty good. Hopefully we, uh, beat Michigan. Yeah. But, um, The Steelers, four and six now. Eh, they're doing better. They, they could be a lot better if they would play right. But you know, you always. I mean, when you get rid of half your team that you had like year before. <laughs> but um, yeah, that's it's about my life. Just a. Poor old white boy going to college is about it. <laughs> but, uh. Alright. Always remember no matter what you do, keep dipping and spitting, and I'll see you later.